Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. I thought I might do a couple of videos on the good and the bad things about riding in the Florida on the Gulf Coast side. Obviously, some really great advantages to Florida. You can ride here all year long, which can be good or bad. But there are some really different places. It's not like riding anywhere else in the United States. Some things you got to watch out for, like September and May, we've got the love bugs. Crack my windshield a minute. Those love bugs, they're just starting to come out now. Um, you'll find them like in the orange groves and wherever there's a lot of foliage. Not too much on the beaches. Um, if you live in a neighborhood like me, I live in a bird preserve. Uh, they're everywhere. But they only happen in September and May. They're just a couple of weeks, but if you get them on your bike or your car, you better get them off right away. They'll eat right through that paint. And in some cases, they've been known to uh, eat through aluminum. So, you gotta watch out for that. One of the reasons I got a blacked out bike is uh, the uh, coating seems to last longer. It's easier to wipe off. And I don't I want to be uh, scraping off stuff on the chrome and having something re-chromed. Right now we're going through uh, downtown Bradenton. We're headed out towards Anna Maria Island, which is a very cool place. I thought it would, might uh, take you out there and show it right into the island. Like, and this is traffic on a Friday, by the way. Uh, traffic starts to get heavy on Friday, believe it or not. There are some awesome places to eat out there. Yeah, wife and I have a few places that we like to go. We go to the beach. We go to uh, Coquina Beach, which is one of the nicest ones. There's all kinds of facilities there. It's actually great for bike parking. A little cafe there. And uh, sometimes we like to go to Longboat Key. So let me catch you on the other side as we get over to the island. So we're getting close to getting on the island here. Definitely worse places to be. The island roads aren't great. Well, they're all right. You're only doing 25 miles an hour. This isn't quite on the island yet. So, like I said, this is kind of a mixed bag here in Florida. We're still in the rainy season, so there'll be an errant cloud here or there if it doesn't rain the entire afternoon. Mrs. Geezer and I have been caught in this drawbridge a number of times, mostly on the weekends, though, so when people come out sailing. So I decided to come out uh, a f Friday uh, afternoon. Don't like this drawbridge. Not good for motorcycle tires. So to the right up here 
is uh, Holmes Beach in the uh, north side of the island. This is Geezer and I uh, have a couple of restaurants up there that we really like. But not really the beaches up there. But if you're looking for uh, really good food, uh, north side of the island's got a bunch of restaurants up there. We're going to head down uh, towards Longboat Key. We won't go that far, but we'll just head down that way. Typical little uh, island towns down here. A lot of people live on this island. And actually, the majority of them uh, live on the north side. Some homes there that are just hundreds of years old. They've survived just about everything. Everyone always worries about hurricanes, but you know what? Those houses are still standing. There's a couple of them I know that were built uh, in the 1880s. There's a few here that are uh, residential too. Mostly uh, these are timeshares and there's some condos here. But uh, some things they call beach resorts that are really glorified motels. And I'm sure they are not cheap. Bradenton Beach is coming up. This is actually a good time to come through here. Of course, it is not tourist season either. I think Anna Maria Island is one of the less, less touristy spots. As a place uh, up here, we like to come to uh, Sunday brunch. It's kind of a big thatched hut. Uh, the uh, Gulf Drive Cafe. It's kind of cool. And we won't go that far, but uh, Coquina Beach is down there. That's that's our favorite place to go. see this is uh, places are right on the ocean here I'll give you uh, a couple of earlier shots of the beach that uh, Mrs. Kieser and I took I'll stick them in here somewhere Yeah, this is one of our favorite places here. But what I'm showing you is kind of the side of Florida that's unique. It's like nowhere else. Uh, maybe we'll go right down to Coquina Beach and turn around. Longboat Key is uh, got some hidden beaches. I may have uh, 
couple of shots of uh, Longboat Key I can stick in there. I think I'll just turn around here. Probably the safest place. bridge to uh, St. Pete. There's a uh, ride going on over there. And uh, there's a few people that are coming from my side of the bridge. We're going to go up over there and join the ride. It's pretty cool shots going over that bridge, the uh, Skyway Bridge. want to get some shots of those uh, areas give you a shot of this uh, place from the uh, other side. So we came back up, or just be coming back off the island. Just go back the way we came. boats coming through, get across that bridge. A lot of places to put your uh, boat in the water down here. It is beautiful here. Of course, every place has its uh, Good and bad spots. After spending 17 years in Colorado, this is a nice change. One of these days I'll uh, tell you why we had to leave Colorado. And it's not for the reasons you might think. more to do with uh, getting tr crowded and turning into California, being unfriendly to uh, law enforcement. Just got really weird. And it's no place to retire, I'll tell you that. Now we know why people pick Florida to retire, because it's a very retirement friendly state. So getting out of Bradenton on a Friday afternoon is a little dicey. In a couple hours it'll be uh, bumper to bumper. You can imagine what it is in uh, tourist season. Ooh, nothing like being next to a garbage truck. You're living down this way in the Gulf side. You're always going over some kind of bridge. A little windy. Somebody ought to do a YouTube video and just all the bridges down here. Maybe I will. There's some astounding bridges down here. I'm gonna get a few of the bikers to go with me. OK, 
Okay, well this is where I turn off to get to the homestead.